Alright everybody, here we are down in the beautiful Gulf of Mexico, fishing right out of Fresnels, the campground, uh, Port St. Joe area, on board with me today, fishing with my brother Mitchell, we're on his boat, we got the Craig Howell and Rob Leppard, some of y'all might remember that boy, uh, he went to school, Albany High, we're going to catch us some fishy. River doing this kind of damage we'll be having us a day and a fish fry tonight. Still can with those catfish. We, we need to keep them. We need to keep some of them catfish. We want to keep wasting bait or we want to move somewhere else. We moving on. Moving on, Mitchell says. Moving on. Turn the cat. We don't want to catch fish we can catch in Albany. We didn't come down here to do that. I can't catch those in Albany. Yeah, <laughs> Mitchell says you can't catch those in Albany. What in the world is all that racket? Oh. Oh yeah, that's a nice fish. He's a decent fish. Oh, Look at that sheephead, baby. Sheephead. Mitchell's calling the shot. That's sheephead. Yep. That's sheephead. Another sheephead. Look at those teeth. Hmm. Sheephead, folks. Good eating fish, kind of bony. Hard to clean. Hard to clean. Mitch says. What's going on? Oh, got old sheepy. Craig Howe. The Craig Howe. Right, Rob hooked, Rob hooked up. up. We got the double going. We got doubles back here. I'll go over here, Rob. And it's all. We got all. Craig still got his on. Good right. sheep. Nice sheepy. All right. Nice. Nice. 
we pulled up over here there was a boat tied up to that buoy and uh i think they were on the wrong side of it yeah they were on the wrong side of it so they probably come over here one time before caught fish over there come right back to it didn't try all around it but see uh you know georgia boys here we're gonna figure it out probably gonna run out of shrimp six dozen may not have been enough Bottom crab, fish on. All right. Go up a little bit. There he is. That's another good sheep. Yes, sir. That's another good one. Good fish. Uh, he's decent. Decent. He said decent. Decent sheep. There we go. Another fish in the box. Yes, sir. Here he is. Ah, yeah. <laughs> A little one. A little. Sheep. That's a sheep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. no. That's my luck. Little bitty fish. Well, keeper. We're going to put it in the box. Oh, yeah. All right. Captain Mitchell, put me on the fish. Live shrimp Rob's hooking up. We're just dropping down. Just dropping down right behind the boat. Fish in the bottom. See what's happened. That shrimp Rob just put on there was big enough to eat. <laughs> this is a pretty big shrimp. Looks like I can catch a big fish with it. Doubled up. Okay, wait a minute. Get back over here. Get back over here. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Sheep, sheep. Good sheep. Oh, he took that one hook, line, and sinker. He got it. There you go. You're going to have to help with that, Mitchell. That's, they swallowed it. Captain Mitchell got the pliers out. We're gonna have to rehook that line. Good sheep head. Good sheep. Down here at Port St. Joe. Awesome time. Beautiful weather. Mitchell's hooked up on something here. Hell yeah, baby. I think of Kobe a time, Craig. Kobe a time. <laughs> oh, no, he didn't. I don't think of Kobe. Oh, oh. That's a good Dang. fish. It's a good fish. Two good runs. Good sheep. Sheep Big sheep. Here, oh Don't man. Nice sheep here there. Oh. Now, if you had a box full of those, you talking about a fish fry. Woo! Woo! That's, that's a monster. That's a monster sheepy. Dang. Trophy. That. Mount that fish. Oh, yeah. You get a picture up. Not that sheep head. Put that one on the wall. 
box. Oh! Oh! Ah, I got some shoulders on me. <laughs> Something was going on over here. We just had a rod sitting out. Oh, sheep. Craig putting a keeper. Keeper sheep. Keeper. Keeper sheep in the boat. A little sheepy. Fish fry, y'all. Fish fry. Sheephead is some good eating, too. I think I saw flyers right there, real quick. That doesn't make the most. Oh! Oh! Yeah! Feisty sheep. Take a ride putting them in the boat. Putting them in the boat. Another one for the box. On the last shrimp, too. <laughs> That's the last shrimp in the boat, right? Too many count. Last shrimp. Last sheep head, probably for today. Simple fishing. Yeah, just a mackerel rig. We're gonna troll, throw this thing out, troll a little bit, see if we can't find a school. All right, what's that? What do we got? That's a, about a four or five ounce trolling lead. It'll go through the water like a bullet. It's gonna spin. Yeah, it's got swivels. Swiveled all the way down it. Swiveled here, swiveled here, swiveled here. That way this thing doesn't twist your line up. Every time you reel it in, it creates a crow's nest in your reel. So the more swivels, the better. Yeah, there's really? fish. Is it? Yeah. Nah, there's nothing on it. Reel it on there, Rob. Let's make sure. Thought I saw something shiny. It might be. Yeah. yeah. There's, something on the, there's something on the spoon. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Nah. Yeah, he's a little. We'll put him back. We'll. Take him off. Pretty. Yeah. He missed. Got right in his eye. There you go, Rob. All right, Rob, just flip the button on it, drop it back in. Right there, pull it down. All right, Craig. Put your thumb on there. Let it go out. Let it go out a little bit. Two nice keys. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Spanish mackerels. Look at that. We got some tangle dangle. That's a nice Spanish right there. For these waters, that's a good Spanish micro right there. Let's do a little choppy back here, everybody. Eight spoon and then eight lower in front of them. Go ahead. Right there? Yeah. Just dropping these rigs out. Trolling these waters behind the cape. See what happens. Go. Fish on. Woohoo! Look out, Rob. Oh, yeah, you got your couple on there. That line was way out there. But we got us so one fish on. Well, that's a double, it's a triple. Triple, 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 triple. triple. Uh, looks like three keepers, too. Looks like three keepers. Like three keepers. Oh, there they are. One, two, three. Doubles. Craig Howell's got one back here. Short. A little short. short. Rob's hooked up. Got one on the spoon, looks like. Yeah, one on the spoon. That one might keep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Look at that blood. These are some bloody fish, y'all. Flipping, flopping. Get him, boy. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> looks like the chainsaw massacre went down back here. Oh my! Oh my! <laughs> the chainsaw massacre. Oh. Get out there, Craig. Bloody fish. Another one for the box. <laughs> Tonight on Dateline NBC. It turned out not to be a simple fishing trip. What you're looking at here is a shark that was caught off the tip of Cape Sandblast there. An 11 year old young lady reeled this shark in. As you can see right here in the dorsal fin area, there is a tag. She is a volunteer tagger for the NOAA organization. What these tags do, if this shark is ever caught again, if the fisherman who catches the shark uh, reports that tag, they can track the movement of these sharks.
Oh, <laughs> cuts uh, like fuck. Now that's uh, one job right here that uh, I don't care to handle. That is my knife, but uh, I've never used it. <laughs> it's being used now. Yeah, it's being used now. <laughs> you're the best fish cleaner I've ever seen. Yeah, keep and, and not to mention, <laughs> you're, not, not, to you're mention, not fooling me, Mitchell. <laughs> like Mitchell said, Craig is the best fish cleaner you have ever seen in your whole life. Look at that. Look at that. He makes it look so easy that it looks like it could be fun. In here and get you some fun. Oh, oh, oh! Good catch. All right, everybody, I got Trey Landry here with me. Uh, he's running the place now. They, they're over here running the place. Captain Trey Landry. Hey, well, Trey, tell us a little bit about Presnells now that you guys have it and what's going on, going on over here. You know, everyone loves Presnells. If you're not familiar with Presnells, we are located south of Port St. Joe in Simmons Bayou, Florida, on County Road C30A. Presnells is a very unique uh, place on the bay in St. Joseph Bay. One, one of the one of the few places in Florida still that you can actually pull a camper up, put a tent up, and, and be on the water and, and see one of the most beautiful sunsets you're going to see in the state of Florida. Sunset. The million dollar sunset, the big trout, redfish flounder, have an opportunity to go offshore and get your big kingfish, snapper grouper in the season, the scalloping down here in the summertime and the camping. Yeah. We also have the Presnell house over here uh, up for rent. Oh, really? First so time that's ever. new then, right? Yeah. Yeah. New. Wow. Uh, we do stand-up kayaks, paddle boards, fully guided excursions, fishing, wow. cruises. We have rental boats, three rental boats. Y'all come on, see us at Presnell's. Give us a call. We'll set you up, whether it's a, a full package guided fishing, hunting, put you in the lodging, get you on the water, get you in a kayak, or just relax and sit out here in the grass and watch the watch all the birds and all the, the sea life. And, and, the, and that beautiful sunset, that oh, million dollar sunset. sunset. You're all right, right about that. We're all blessed. Come and see us. Honestly, uh, could you ever get tired of seeing that? Maybe used to it, but never tired. Hope you enjoyed today's show. Hope to see you right back here next weekend. So long from Port St. Joe, Press Nails Campground.